But before I go in on this episode all out episode 19, let me just touch on this bun. You're talking a lot of shit. Okay? All that chit chat, all them gunfires, okay, you let loose on this series all out. Check yourself. You better stop with all the shots. Cause I'm coming for you, okay? I will seckies on your ass, bro. I will lay your ass out. You have no knees. Okay, you you, you you have no knees, bro, so your knees gonna buckle, okay? When I hit you, you're gonna be laid the fuck out, okay? You're gonna be breathing so hard, you're gonna catch you. <laughs> Why'd you hit me like that? Because you're talking that shit about All Out, man, okay? Hajime Ipo, okay, you can, oh my god, I need my Hajime, okay, I need that shit too, but All Out's here, okay? It's legit, it's hype, okay? There's a potential with this series, okay? That's factual, okay? I'm tired of you talking ill will about this series, okay? Stop talking about freaking All Out before I have to eboom in your ass, track you the fuck down, then lay your ass down like Seki's out, okay? Okay? If you don't want that to happen, stop stop talking shit about all out, okay? Stop talking shit about all out. Enough said. Anyways, all out episode freaking 19, people. This episode was really freaking crazy. Oh, how we know? Just let me. The coordination, the playmaking skills, directing his teammates, okay? Guillaume. Imashimizu, bro, just directing his team. He blew me with the with the call out, kicking the ball. He can, he's fast, he can catch it. The call outs, guiding Guion, okay, making a play, interceptions. Oharano, I mean, after, when, when Komori asked him, Yo, you want to you wanna play? Oh, well, not really. I don't know. The way he looked, it looked kind of, it was hype, okay? It was like a dick answer, asshole answer, not really. It's like, come on, man, come like, on. You part of the team? Like, Ibumi said, you've been moping and sobbing. For a week now on the bench. Okay, get your ass in the, in, in the game, man. And he, he looks like, okay, he's meshing well with the team. As, as, yeah, they're bickering, they're going, but it's, it's all love. All teammate love, okay? They're cool. I mean, what Oharano brought to this game at the end of the game was very, very great to see. It was great. Guillaume scored a freaking point. He scored a point! It was a decoy. I mean, he's, he's protecting his teammates. He's creating plays, interceptions. Okay, he scored a point. His first point. Yeah, it's a practice game, but that's a lot. That says a lot about Guillaume as a character, as a rugby player, how far he came. I mean, still a beginner, still a noob, okay? But he came so far from day one until now. Look where Guillaume's at right now. Look what type of plays he's making. Look what type of... of of skills that he has now than before. It was crazy to see. Great to see also the connection relationship between Rinpei and Osaka, okay, so now, I guess as a kid, you know what I'm saying, he, he get into the rugby sport, he saw Rinpei, he thought he was cool, okay, he kicked the ball, he catch it, he was so cool, ever since they even following him. Okay, Rinpei been a dick since he was a kid, man. He don't care about nobody, don't care about friends, he don't care about his teammates, don't care about nothing. All, all they care about is winning. Okay, I understand the mentality because Michael Jordan had a mentality, okay? A lot of great athletes has that mentality, okay? Champion, champ, champ, championship team, Hall of Famers have that mentality, okay? Don't care. I care about winning. But a lot of these athletes, a lot of these championship players, Hall of Famers, they care about making them not only themselves good, but their teammates good as well. Okay, it's not all about self. It's about you and making your teammates better on your level, if not better than you. Okay, to win more games, be a, a better team all around, a franchise, be a a dynasty team. Okay, Ring is all about self. Okay, some part I get, other parts I mean, like like uh, Osaka said, bro, he got on his ass. Okay, if you ain't gonna do shit. You might as well go to the hotel and do the same thing you're doing right now on the field. Nothing. So, why are you here? Just go. Leave. Go back. Like, you ain't doing shit. You, you kick, you're kicking the ball half-ass. Okay, you, you're sitting there critiquing, but you're not doing nothing. You're not contributing to the team. Not only Osaka got a rampe, shots been fired. That direction, he got on his teammates. Y'all freak want to blame Rempe for everything, but you can't always blame him. Okay, it's about you too. What are you doing? 
Okay, you're not tackling, you're doing this and that, you, you're moping around, you just, you just bring a negativity, you blame a rampage, but what are you doing with your actions? What are you doing with the plays? What are you trying to do? So Osaka's trying to make plays, he's, tr he's not trying to lose, okay, he's tired of losing, he wants to win, okay, he's doing by himself, okay, and what Osaka did boost morale, okay, he talked some sense into the rest of his teammates, to the captain, everybody's like, okay, shit, man, this dude was by himself, he does not want to lose game is all 100%. Okay. And you know what? Yeah, what he said was some factual shit. And guess what? We're going to back him up. Okay. Rampe, I don't know what the fuck happened to him. Okay. He got, he was, he, he had no word to say, no comeback. Because what, what Osaka said, what he said was true shit. You, you sitting here talking all that shit, but what are you doing to contribute to the team? What are you doing to make the team win? You, 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 you're way back. Sitting there critiquing us when you're not doing jack shit, you, you, you kicking the ball half ass, you're not doing shit. But move on to Jinko, man. Kafune, bro, with the kicks, with the extra point. Oh, how are no coming in? See more of his skills that we can bring to the team, okay? And, and what he is, how much of a big of an asset he is as a player and to the team, just coordination. Uh, just directing his teammates, creating plays, calling out plays, and you know, making plays. That was great to see. Uh, Sekiza once again with them hits. A boomy cheetah, straight up fast as a fucking cheetah, bro. Legs just glorious, man. Just, just gazelle. Uh, Guillaume, great to see Guillaume. Okay, Guillaume scoring a point, making plays, uh, backing up his teammates, looking for a chance ball. Just, you know, just. Just creating plays, tackling, and helping his teammate push forward, not fall back, okay? And just, you know, creating openings for his team. That was great to see. Uh, and the rest of the team, just, you know, all that hard work Kamori put them through, all that training is paying off, okay? that They won a game. Granted, it's a practice game, but it's a win. Uh, it's, a, it's, it's a great boost for morale, okay? I mean, they've been losing, what? For a long time, okay, even with practice games, okay, but with this win, even though it was a practice game, that shows how much of the hard work paid off, how much all the training of what Komori put these kids through and everything, okay, and it, it, it paid off. Practice game or not, it's still a game, man, and yeah. Okay, and Red Pants almost got this game while it's the soccer ball. It's like, bro, it's at the point, man. It's about winning, man. Practice game, no practice game. It's still about winning, man. We still want to win, right? We be losing, bro. Come on, man. Bring this shit to the. I mean, you, if you acting like this in a practice game, imagine in a, an actual game. Where the pressure is more real, it's an actual official game. Okay? Y'all freaking acting like this in a practice game? It gets to an actual game. Different. Different atmosphere, different type of pressure, man. It's, it's more crazy, man. And you know, and that that point in this episode of Saga was like, yo, I'm not fuck, I'm, I'm tired of following him, man. Be my own man, be my own leader, and, 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 and be my be my own man. That's, that's what he did. Okay, stop being the shadows of a rim pain, be your own man, be your own player, man. And bring him to the team yourself, okay? Which he did. Okay? And it was great to see Second Star help him up and you know like good shit, like okay, yeah, good shit. I see what he's doing. But yeah, man. Uh, Tenjiku ten versus Jinko. What a great practice game. Great. We see, you know, different players, different atmosphere, different uh, relationship with players. Since we're in play on soccer. Also, seeing the Jinko team mesh come to come 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 together as a team. Oh, how I'm stepping on the field, just bring to the table. Guillaume. You know, I see Mizu. You know, so still my shit list. And second side. He blew me, everybody else in the Jinko team brought it in this type of game. It was a great intense game, very emotional game, especially when they were talking to their best friends. It was like, oh, it was kids, man, like, you know, in the sandbox days, okay? Pretty much practically brothers, pretty much, okay? And to see the relationship, see how, you know, how it happened, you see just what's like, it's kind of impatient, and just like, you know, I'm tired of following you, man, like, you know, just like, stop bitching. If not, get the fuck off the field, get the bench, go back to the hotel, because you ain't bringing up but you ain't doing shit. Wait, wait, guys. I see Galera all up to 19. I feel like it's only up to 11 this season. This season is over. No word of season 2. 
but uh, I would love an actual game. Okay, actual game. Can we get that? Just one, just one game to end, end the season. Just, just give me one game. One actual game. Um, but the way it's going, I'm pretty sure we're not because this is summer camp. I'm pretty sure we get practice games. So yeah. So there's that. So this whole season was pretty much practice games. But okay, season two actual game. The the the, pro the progression. Okay, I see the journey. I understand. But anyway, guys, I'm out, man.